Hello folks, Tim here again with some more Star Wars Galaxy of Heroes. And here we are. It is day 71. We are still 79, but we're creeping up on 80, which is pretty cool. Uh, let's take a look at where we are today. So in our arena, uh, we are rank 713 in the squad, and we're 156 in the fleet. So believe it or not, we won four out of five of our fleet battles today. Uh, so that was that was pretty pretty awesome. And so I took out. Um, let's go in here into our ships. So I put some work into the ships today. Um, I took out the Tie Silencer, and I put in Houndstooth, but I brought Houndstooth up to seventy. Um, and, you know, put some, um, some stuff into their abilities. So, I, I improved the ship, and I, I took out the silencer, and I added that in. And I also brought, uh, the bomber up to level 70. And that unlocked, uh, some more of its abilities, so we upgraded those. Our Imperial TIE Fighter, we did the same. We, we brought it up to 70. And we put some points into um, its abilities. So, um, you know that 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 Imperial fleet's coming along, coming along. We're do, we're doing some good stuff with that. And you know, not much going on as far as character progression. Like we bought, we got Boba Fett his seventh star today. Um, you know, nothing. <clears throat> excuse me, nothing to put his points into here we didn't upgrade his gear and you know he had his mods before we are target farming captain rex to get his seventh star and we're 87 out of 100 with that we brought bosk uh where is he right here so we brought in order to enhance this ship we brought bosk up to uh level 70 and, you know, we put, we put some mods on him, and we upgraded some of his abilities. Um, as soon as we can get him more armor pieces, uh, we're definitely going to upgrade his gear. Where we put most of our effort today was into our CLS teams. So we went ahead and we brought everybody up to level 50. Even R2. Uh, we we put whatever mods we could on everybody, so Han Han can get uh, Han can get some some more mods on him, and, and that's what I'm doing right now is I'm just auto assigning them, and uh, you know we'll upgrade them, you know from there. So you know we can get another we can get another point in his leadership ability, and then you know old Ben brought him up to 50 and r2 we put what mods we had on him uh we haven't brought any of his abilities up yet but we brought him up to gear level five and and that like i said is where most uh where most of our effort went today like we spent a lot of a lot of credits uh bringing these guys up so we're back down we we were at five million when i started the day today and we're we're back down to 127.8 thousand so um you know but hey you know we're progressing so that's what our bounty hunter team is looking like and then you know this is where we're gonna where we're gonna pretty much focus i did tar i did target farm some veers today uh some piet some dark trooper um, you know, Django Fett, because that's where, um, that's where the Hound's Tooth is. And, you know, some more Mara Jade. And we didn't, we haven't been, we haven't been aiming for Bastula lately. Um, mainly just because we're focused right now on getting the CLS unlock. So, um, you know, that's, that's pretty much it for characters. And we've already covered our arena in our Galactic War. Once again, we cleared the whole thing, which was super awesome, and we are even we we are on such a roll with that. I am so excited. I'm hoping that once we hit 85, we can multi sim, and we won't have to do it daily anymore. 
there is um, something else that we worked on today. Load screen. So we, we worked on uh, our ship battles a little bit today. Um, we, we completed uh, Fleet 2 hard mode. So we can now farm um, the Raven's Claw if we so choose. But I, I targeted uh, I targeted Slave One today for for our ship uh, target farm, and then we started uh, Fleet Battle Three. So we've completed uh, the first three. We three start them, and we're on this one. I ran out of energy for it, so that's why we didn't um, we didn't continue on with that, or else we would have. In our events. There wasn't really anything we could do today. Um, the the Inquisitorious, that ends uh, in, in 14 hours. And we didn't get any further. I tried it a couple more times uh, for Tier 5, and it just didn't go well. So we're still at Tier 4, and, you know, just a refresher. We're going to get some, you know, Second Sister Shards. We're going to get some Fifth Brother Shards and a couple mods, some, some credits and some shipbuilding material. Um, other than that, there was really nothing we could work on today. You know, this doesn't start, you know, this starts in a day. So, there, there wasn't really a whole lot that we could, um, that we could get into. You know, our, our, our guild event, and that refreshes in five minutes. You know, I, I've been, I've been doing what I can in there. And, um, you know, we're working on a Sith Triumvirate raid, and, and I've done, I, I've done everything that I can, you know, like, <laughs> I entered the battle, I just didn't, I couldn't do any damage to it, but that's okay, right, because, because I'm a nub, <laughs> sorry, I'm a newbie, I'm still, I'm still in the early game, right, I haven't even, um, you know, I haven't even hit 85 yet, so technically I am still uh, a, a, an early game player. Let's open this data card. Maybe we'll get another Jawa. And we got gear. Which is okay. We like gear. Gear is good. Gear is our friend. But, you know, that's that's pretty much it. That's pretty much all we got um, accomplished today. You know, uh, and, and we're kind of shifting a little bit from our original layout for Phase 1, right? Because it was supposed to get the Emperor Grandmaster Yoda... And then Thrawn. But now that I've decided to go after uh, the Executor and um, Jabba the Hutt for my first two, like, big things, I, I decided to kind of pivot away from that, right? Um, you know, so we're going to keep working on our Empire so that we can 7-star R2. We're going to keep working on getting Rex to 7 stars so we can get 7 stars for Palpatine. We can get 7 stars for Vader. And now we've kind of gone toward focusing on our CLS team so that we can unlock CLS, which it's going to be a huge, huge boost for the account, right? We're going to slowly bring along the Imperial Troopers, and we're going to start focusing um, on, on, on the Bounty Hunters. So that we can go after uh, Chewbacca. And then we can go after the Millennium Falcon. So, you know, we've, we've altered our plans a little bit. You know, we're, we're still, still kind of picking up Geos where we can. Um, you know, the Brood Alpha is the only thing we don't have. So, we're going to, when we first get CLS, we're going to use Han Solo. And then we're going to use some of the, the people that we use to unlock him. Until we can get Chewbacca, until we can get 3PO and Chewie, and until we can get C-3PO himself. And so we're working on the bounty hunters to go after Chewbacca. And we're going to start working on our Ewoks a little bit. Like you can see, I got some Ewok shards. Like I've been using random leftover uh, stuff to go after Cheap Chirpa uh, and Wicket. And, you know, the Elder, we can, we can get another star on the Elder. And then Princess Nisa we can farm. Uh, if we want. 
So, because she's right here. So we can farm her, you know, when we're ready. But I really, really want to get, you know, the full CLS team uh, as quickly as possible. You know, um, and then, you know, pretty much what Geo's, just Geo's for Padme, like this is, this is, this is trash. <laughs> I, I, I thought I was being cute, and I was looking at an old team that I used, which is which is why that came up. So, you know, um, where am I? I am done. And 3PO and Chewie, we can farm. And I, I believe that is the CLS team uh, that I want. So, you know, um, I'm pretty excited, like, where we're going. And I'm really excited by our progress. Like, I didn't think at this point that we would have all these seven star characters. Um, you know, and theoretically I could level Zeb up and probably take him in and get um, the Emperor and Thrawn, you know, using Zeb. But eventually we're going to come back to building up the Phoenix team. And yes, Ezra's going to leave and then we can plug Zeb in. Or, you know, we could plug in, um, what's her name, Sabine, right? But I, I honestly did not think we were going to have all these seven-star characters at this point. I didn't think we were going to have Han Solo at this point. So I'm, I'm super excited about where we're going. I'm super excited about where we are. Oh, shit, look at that. I forgot. <laughs> we can get... Uh, I don't have the credits, so I need a million credits. But we can seven-star... Uh, General Kenobi, and then we can plug him in somewhere. Probably on our um, Jedi team, right? With with Bastila. Let's go in and take a, a a peek. Right, so we could take out Mace Windu, and we could plug in uh, General Kenobi with our Grandmaster Yoda. I think that is a I think that is a thing we could do. I think that's pretty cool. You know, uh, can we even throw him in here to maybe try to try to get Yoda unlocked? And who would we take out, right? But, yeah. And, and, and I could sit here all day and theorize, you know, with you guys about, uh, you know, all the different things we can do. But uh, I think I'm going to go ahead and I think I'm going to get out of here. Oh, what do we got in our inbox? Okay, so there are new orders for our um, Hoth battle, right? So we can go in. So I'm guessing... I, I probably don't have anybody to kill. You need Colonel Stark and Veers, so I, I don't have those or else I would absolutely try for that. get out of this let's go into this and let's see so I have I just don't have anybody built up right like Django doesn't have enough stars I, I don't have the resources to build these guys up uh, to contribute to that so I think we'll just go ahead and we'll go in here and we'll just deploy everybody The, the drawbacks of focusing on Rebels first. <laughs> so, we've done that, and then I, we should contribute here, right? So, 222,000 points. You know, and, and I, I do what I can, you, you, you know. Um, and, and I think that's really all anybody wants out of me. All right, so now I am really going to get out of here. I hope you all have a great day slash night, depending on what... What is this? <laughs> Sorry, I'm easily distracted. I'm a squirrel. Okay, so, you know, we get some, uh, some tokens there. All right, I'm really going to get out of here. Once again, I hope you have a great day slash night, depending on when you watch this. Please like the video. 
Uh, if you're just finding us for the first time, there's a playlist that goes all the way back to day one. And please subscribe to the channel. Uh, you know, we're growing. We're growing at a pretty good pretty good rate. Last I looked, we were at 363 subscribers. So, um, you know, that's exciting. Uh, working our way up to five. Five is the, is the big milestone uh, that I'd like to hit. And, uh, you know, please comment. Um, I, I do love the comments i love the insight i love it when when you guys are like oh man you know i'm i'm right behind you or you know oh i just jumped ahead of you or hey you know i just unlocked r2 i i love that stuff i love the comments i look forward to it it is the first thing i do in the morning uh, when i get up and i get at my desk and i make my coffee um you know i, I click on uh I click on, on the channel and I, and I go through all the comments. I might not, not answer them for an hour because, you know, I'm not a morning person. It takes me a little bit to wake up. But I, I do uh, absolutely do love the comments. All right, folks. I'm out of here.